Hey, good Monday evening to you. We are now only 48 days away from a natural phenomenon that will envelop Arkansas in darkness. We are talking about the total solar eclipse of April 8th. Some institutions of higher learning are seizing the opportunity to both educate and entertain those who are making the journey to the natural state to be in the path of totality. Channel 7's Andrew Mobley visited the University of Central Arkansas today to see how they're preparing. Andrew. It's not so much a question of what UCA, UC, University of Central Arkansas, is planning for the eclipse. Rather, uh, what isn't it? So on April 8th, we'll have multiple viewing parties on campus, including a watch party at Estes Stadium. It's free and it's open to the public. We'll have eclipse glasses to give away. Vendors will be there. Food concessions will be available. It's going to be a great family atmosphere. Just in case the significance of April's total solar eclipse is lost on anyone, it's worth noting just how rare the celestial events are. For anybody, for any spot on the planet, you've got about one every 375 years. So the, so the odds are pretty low for any particular spot on the planet. Uh, so unless you make a, an effort to go to the path of totality, you probably won't see one in your lifetime. And the University of Central Arkansas is taking full advantage of the moment and has even created a mascot of sorts for the eclipse. We have, among other things, um, commissioned an artist to create a 25-foot tall inflatable sculpture. Um, that is going to depict a superhero character we've created called Luna. The evening before the day of the eclipse, NASA astrophysicist Amber Strawn will be giving a lecture on campus. Knowing that she was an Arkansas native and that she works with the James Webb Telescope, we were very excited to bring her back to Arkansas to give a free public lecture. UCA isn't exactly operating under the principle of build it and they will come. The state is expecting 1.5 million out-of-state tourists, and folks from far and wide have already stated their intention to view the eclipse at UCA. And people from around the country have been RSVPing, saying that they were going to come here for the day of the eclipse. So we expect visitors from multiple states and all over our state to come to Conway that day. According to the university, eclipse visitors from as far as California and Florida plan on viewing the celestial event from campus. On your side, I'm Andrew Mobley. Okay, looking forward to it, Andrew. Thanks very much. If for whatever reason you're unable to view the April 8th eclipse, fear not. You won't have to wait 375 years. Arkansas's next total solar eclipse will occur in August 2045.